Hello everybody, this is the Dragon Age out here. Today is a very special episode of my channel. This is the Skyforge tutorial that my friends have asked for. And here today I break down the basic game mechanics. So first off, here is the basic battle. And this is where you access all your maps and scads with the mention game. This is the very first map of the game. And as you see, it's a turn based SRBG. It takes place on a grid where you control your characters versus you move them. Show you. And there's variable options attack, special, left, defend. Here I'm attacking this printer. And then you click execute or in turn to execute commands like here. Here's also team attack. Here I come. You place characters nearby each other in order to perform a special combination attack. Want to see? God, bless me. You have to place some first aid here. Watch the fire. Got hammered down. Poor guy. Now see that, that's that. And now if you want to end your turn, click end turn. As you see, my character is too strong and they easily counter. If your enemy attacks one of your characters, your characters can counter attack for damage and possibly kill them. And here, these things, these blocks are called Geo blocks, which modify these colored tiles called Geo Counts on them. Like here, man, plus 50. And here is the special deck. Oh, yeah, it's not me. That's the best coming up. I was told to always just be blown up. Steal for you, friend. That's the basic battle, folks. I'm um, gonna show you some more. This is the second map. Now I'll show you what the left command does. If you want to get to a spot you can't reach him on turn, you can use this. Here I come. Like here, pick up them, and then she picks up them. And what? You can go your character in a straight line or die to a special trick. And as you see, you can easily. Attack these guys since he got thrown over all the way over there. Follow my own present your vile soul! Aw, oh, look at that. That's real camper, yeah. Some brutal domination! Often very suit to scat four. First one is Magic King, it's also actually in the scat three and the scat two PSP. And the second one is Fusion. Where you do two want to get now this is where it's changed for your mod to keep your own and then gain special skills based on that weapon. The second one is mod fusion when you use two mods together. Fusion, ha! Now see? Look how big it is. And watch. That doesn't look good. BAM! Basic battle against Sky uh, 4, that's how uh, battle can work out. And now I'm going to show you some of the functions of the base. So here, this is hospital where you heal, because you don't often really heal after battles in Sky. Here is the ability shop, which is in Sky 3 and 4, not 1, 2, or the new Sky D2, where you buy skills. Like, see, for example, this guy can learn almost all the Spirit skills are for two and all the Zoliac skills except for three. And there's also skill boosting where you upgrade your skills to cause more damage. And you use mana, which you gain from battle to upgrade your skills. And these are also abilities or abilities, which you can on that to use one of the ability where you has special effect on battle. And you can have the two abilities at once, primary and secondary. These are the shops. Weapons, armor, items, and whatnot. And now this is the Dark Assembly, a very special feature. 
This is where you use members and Are you ready? which stage you have conquered and risk breaking past bills such as triple experience, strong enemies that can actually help you. But of course, your approval rate depends on your favorable standard of dark assembly. And this is character creation where you can create any character with any preset class and higher tiers and higher colors. You can also name them anything you want. Keep in mind that each class has their own strengths and weaknesses, so choose the device of your own team character. I'm using the name Iron Man because you need to kind of mind your Iron Man that suit. And then you can choose which dead spoofs and voila! Create a new character. Come and here's some intros. There's already going to be intros when you create characters yeah. unless you choose to skip the triangle. So that's this tutorial for today, and thanks for watching. Please leave a like and subscribe. Dragging it out.